Hello everybody, my name is Mathis and welcome to Absolver. Absolver is going to be coming out soon, it is the new fighting-esque game from Devolver Digital. It has been a game that has been hyped up for quite a long time and I've kept myself away from because of spoilers basically. It looks really interesting but I actually Outside of being excited for it, really don't know much about it. And this will be a, a one-off video unless it like people are super pumped for it. But I want to play some Absolver, show you what the game is before the game comes out, obviously. And obviously give you my first thoughts and impressions as I play the game. Um, I, I Let's just start a new game and hopefully you'll understand what, what we're looking at here. So, uh, Origin. Ice Marshes, Orate, the tier. Like, I think this just it dictates the color of my skin. Uh, we'll go, we'll be from the ice marshes because I am pale as fuck. Um, I mean, male or female doesn't really matter. Haircut. Ooh. Ooh, the haircut. My favorite of all things to customize. is not a much wild. Sure, that's about as close as you can get. And I'm like a brown haired. Okay, is, is, does actually, does it change anything? We're going to go with Aur Auburn, I guess. Because that's the closest we've got. Um, hit accept. Combat style. So we get to choose the kind of combat style we have. I don't know if we get to change that later. Uh, we got the Forsaken combat style. Balanced combat style with a slight focus on strength. Blocks uh, active ability parry. Blocks completely the attack and stun and stun your opponent. Got it. And then we've got Kot Kaltel method. Improves mainly strength and vitality. Uh, dismisses the stun of the attack. The lost health can be recovered. Windfall improve, uh, improves mainly dexterity, and we get the avoid. Avoids and slows down the attack. Uh, okay, and then we got Forsaken. So there's only three. It's like easy, medium, and hard. I kind of like the way Windfall looks. So why don't we go with that for now and hope that this is going to be something we can either mess with or modify later. Name. Well, my name is Mathis, so let's go with that. Mathis. And we'll accept that. So I think we can just make multiple different people. It does show that there's a new game and continue and stuff. Um, so it is online. The game is online. You can play in offline mode. But I think you can run across other players and fight them and just take their shit if you run into them. I'm pretty sure. Hopefully all these will, all that will be answered as we play. I guess this is like the opening because I'm from the ice marshes. So that's, you know, what we're looking at. Ooh, ooh, pick me, pick me. Hell yeah, dog. Let's go. that spoopy ghost yeah okay old man what's up with the spoopy ghost all right so he made my mask magic be my guess. So I can see, I'm assuming like I can see through the mask. Oh, all right. We're getting teleported, I guess? I don't know what's going on, man. Bring it on, though. The game is really pretty. I love the art style. Whoa, controls are in, so you're gonna, you're gonna learn very quickly here that, uh, I'm a scrub because I like to invert my camera. <laughs> I played way too many flight sims back in the day. Cool. And that's kind of how I always adapted. I played a ton of Ace Combat, and that's kind of where I picked up that habit. The sensitivity of the joystick is crazy. Planes of a doll. That's a really, really, really pretty sight. Is there a jump button? No. I don't know if I want to jump down there quite yet, but that's a really pretty sight. Hello? Tap to lock. Uh, and then, okay, and then I can do that. Okay, okay, I get it. 
try to pop that open. So tap it, and then... Like so. Alright, alright. Ooh. Hey, Mr. Man. How you doing over there, buddy? You guys look like you might be lost. Uh, alright. That's fine. I love the little maneuvers he's got. All right, so it consumes stamina. My stamina bar is at the bottom. I don't know what that little marker on my stamina bar does, though. If you notice, there was like a little triangle marker there, and I'm not quite sure why. Can't go through there. Your combat deck has four stances. Each uh, starts with different attacks. Enter each stance once. So we're locked. So we've got... Okay, so we have to change it there. It's just the way we face. But what is it? So it all starts with different attacks. And then it will face us in one way. Alternative attacks change your stance, allowing you to chain smoothly with other attacks. So it changes into my other stance. Okay. It seems to go... It skips that one for some reason. So what if I what if I move here and then go there? All right. I, I feel like this is going to be one of those games that's going to be like easy to to pick up and play, but difficult as hell to master. Some attacks even have a special property. What does that even mean? Breaking attacks. So that doesn't break it, but if I go here, it it will. Okay. How do you learn that? Hey, how's it going, girl? Faint. Uh, guard also allows you to cancel an attack if pressed immediately after atta after attacking. Okay, okay. So it's got a fighting game kind of thing going there. This is going to be a game that I think I might really, really enjoy. But it's going to take a lot for me to learn. Okay. Which I think is cool, mind you. Oh, hey, I didn't even realize there was anybody there. Oh, if, okay, so hold up. If I, if I combo... Okay, I'm looking at my bar here. Alright, next time I'm locked into somebody, we're going to try something out. It looks like if I attack right when the bar hits that little, little triangle marker, things get good. Like, we get, like, a little bonus or something. I'm not entirely sure, though. Alright, let's try it. Yeah, there's a, I think there's a combo going there. I think. I could be I could be a hundred percent insane at the same time. Hello? Can't lock onto it. Didn't do anything. Dodge. Alright. I need to, what I don't like is that in order to swap, I have to hold down right bumper. Because there's gotta be an easier way of doing that. Because fighting multiple people is gonna be kind of a pain in the ass if I can't change my, my target to like Batman style. Hits feel real good though. And I don't know what I'm earning either. Yeah. That just seems to be a trigger spot. When I walk past that, it tells me how to dodge. Thought I heard walking. Can't go in there. Is there a keyhole there?
Doesn't open from this side. Okay. Well, let's see if this opens, if we go close to it. Find and defeat Cylon, or Cylon. Okay. Interesting. Hey. Yeah, I'm pretty sure if I if I time it right, I smack exceptionally hard. <laughs> I'm a smacker, if you know what I'm saying. Hey, do you want to come at me? I wonder if I can just unlock and fight manually. It looks like yes. Yeah, I can. I think. So I can meditate. Now, because I got level up. And this is straight up level. Okay. Developing one six is an important tradition in the Adal Imperial family whose value grace increased damage of attacks based on dexterity, which is mostly what I do, if I remember correctly. So why don't we... Pop into dexterity. This game is weird. It's cryptic and vague, but it's kind of cool. Ooh, there's fighting happening. Jump, duck, or do a sidestep, respectively low, high, or vertical attacks. I wonder if that's another player or if those are NPCs fighting it out. Ooh, okay. So I can, okay, I can avoid it. So when you get, like, really good, if you can read attacks, you can duck under. That's cool. Okay. This game is... I feel like this game might be built for 1v1, so I'm a little nervous if they start throwing a lot of people at you, how you're going to really be able to manage it. That must be the shortcut. Alright, hey, Salon. Door Guardian, huh? I'm trying to, like... I don't know what the purpose of, like being in a different stance really matters outside of being able to smash down a door if I'm in a very particular stance. And there's gotta be like a way to read when I when I can press the button, the right button, uh to, to combo up with that with that little meter on the, the little triangle on the meter below without the need to look at the meter, you know what I mean? All right, well, I guess we're gonna swing down here. All right, let me through, please. Hi, uh, before I go in there, let's meditate. I think we throw a, a point in health at the very least. Bring us to a nice five vitality. Give me a little bit of a uh, breathing room. Hey. Do you fight? Who are you? Talk to. I am Talum. I will try to help you as you progress, but if you lose yourself to the fold, I won't be able to save you. I don't know what that means, man. Those who wear the mask are not all your enemies, you know. I will not attack you, okay? When you are safe, you can enter meditation and practice your combat deck. In meditation, you can practice and edit your combat deck. All right, well, let's take a look at what that means. Practice. Bare hands. That's all I've got. Uh, dexterity, mobility, and strength. I don't know. That's a... Uh, okay. Practice. I don't know what that means, man. In the practice mode, you can edit your combat deck stances. Okay, hang on. So that's combo. This is very, very confusing. I don't understand. Stop charging attacks. Strong impact on guard. Break halts. Oh, this is a... Uh, alternative attacks. So this is a, a sequence. If I start here... What does this mean? XX? 
And this is just Y, our Y attack. Okay, so if I'm in the top right stance and hit XX, it goes there. If I'm in this stance, I'll go kick, and then I can chain into something else. And it'll finish me in, oh, finish in a different stance. So it goes from here, kick, kick. This is weird, man. I don't understand why this is red now. So that puts it there. Okay, this these means they're already being used, I think. Speed and range. Well, we'll put that in then. I think I kind of get it. Okay, that's the that's the move I just went and it moves me into that the bottom right one. Okay, I can't actually leave that stance with some in it. This one changes me up and then eventually all leads into that stance there. So I guess like the the mastering is going to have to come from really knowing when to switch and what it's going to bring me into. It's weird. It's weird. It's weird. Tips. Perfect attacks. Attack recovery can be canceled by performing another attack at the right timing. The timing depends on the already initiated attack and the feedback is by a light blink on your character. The stamina god also has precise feedback timing. So that must be what that was then. So if I go like that. The, the blinking is difficult to read, though. The, like, the blinking happens so fast. I can see what they mean, though. That triangle is what I thought it was. All right, uh, what else we got? Shards. Tension shards allow you to use powers and draw the weapon you equipped. Tension shards refills when you perform successful defensive actions or damage. Powers, power one, power two. Right, let's try that. No, no powers yet. Weapons. You can summon your equipped weapon when you have enough tension shards. Durability. Weapons have durability. Once broken, it folds back into your inventory. It cannot be used until it has been fully restored. All right. Uh, what else we got then? You can be disarmed if you take too much damage in a row. When disarmed, the weapon falls to the ground. Free for your opponent to take. That's interesting. Damage bonus. Weapons give different damage bonus depending on the attack's combat style. Damage type. Cut reduction. Mobility. There's just so much. Attack learning. You can learn new attacks by defeating your opponent. Successful defensive actions on an attack gives you temporary attack XP for it. When you defeat your opponent, you validate this XP. Okay. Rush. Rush is not available in this fight stance. Got it. Lock. We already know. Stances, we already know. All right, so that's all stuff that we've already learned. All right, buddy, I, I did it. When you learn new attacks from others, you'll be able to use them in your combat deck. You may not need this right now, but this will be useful when you face tougher enemies. All right, man. That's kind of cool. Fighting other players, I can assume, is valuable for that then. Hold on. So I pressed a left bumper. Okay, this is going to be bit of a problem with so many people. I'm trying to just dodge around here and let me get my... Okay, yeah, you guys fight each other. I'm just trying to, like, learn my, my the flashing. Like, I'm going to need to get really interesting... Uh, reflexes. And I say interesting reflexes. What I mean is I need to get good reflexes the more I play this. So, wait, hold up. Okay, this is that. Rush. Rush is not available in this stance. Okay. Um, so there's like little emotes, I guess. Cool. So, I, I, I bet you it's unlikely that we'll actually be able to communicate with other players outside of emotes. Man, this game could be incredible. 
Like, I have like, just this gut feeling that this game with a good community could be insane. My fear with this game is that there's gonna be an optimal build and everybody's gonna go for that optimal build and it's just gonna, it's gonna kind of ruin a lot of stuff, but I hope it doesn't. That's just the internet for you. So this game's gotta be like a loot based game, right? You head into an area, you fight things, you get loot and then you leave maybe? Kinda escape from Tarkovy. I honestly could see myself falling in love with this style of game. All right, well, let's play a little bit more. Guidance Bridge. No jumping, though. Can I bust this open? Nope. Uh, hello. Activate the altar. Let's talk to this guy before I activate anything. To become an absolver, you will have to prove your worth and defeat Ricerin in the hanging gardens of the Tower of Adal. But first, you must beat Kuritz in the Coliseum, Kilnor and her brother Cargill in the old birdhouse, and the six Mark ones roaming the city in the forest. Only then will the stone gate of the Imperial Tower open. This headstone will show you remaining targets. Beware of those foes. Of these foes, they will not be defeated easily. Activate the altar then. Interact. What are we getting? Combat trials? A traditional duel to the death to determine the most valorous combatants. Kill your opponent three times to win the game. Why don't we see what this is? Oh, it's against other players. I doubt we'll find anybody quite yet. I don't want to sit here and wait. All right, we'll, we'll, we'll not do that right now. Social, invitations. So you can play with your friends. I don't have any equipment, I don't think. I do not. I just have my, my base stuff. Prospect mask. All right, well, let's play a little bit more. I'm into it, let's go. I, I actually can't see anything over here. Okay, that's better. I wanna get some gear, man. A skill-based, kind of MMO light loot treadmill game with interesting fighting mechanics that are going to be fucking hard as hell to make work. What is this? I'm into it. So my power is on the left? I don't understand. So the bottom left shows, I think, what my powers are. And I have that. I think that's my avoid one that slows down attacks and stuff. This is some Animu, weeb, dream come true game, I think. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. I gotta remember what, what does what here. Okay. I'm trying to learn like where attacks are gonna come from and stuff. I think that's gonna be the best. Okay, I'm trying to dodge here. Which, I know spamming is like, not what you're supposed to be doing in this game. So I'm trying not to. Okay, we got some of our life back there, but not a ton of it. Hey, buddy. It's a lady, never know, not a buddy here, okay. I gotta be careful with my stamina here. All right, there is, this is gonna be, I'm, <laughs> I'm starting to see that the, uh, the opening of the game was a little bit more difficult. 
Wow. Or a little bit less difficult, rather. Silent braces. Okay, let's actually throw on some gear, shall we? Alright. So we take less cut damage, but more blunt damage. I think I'm going to leave my prospect gloves on for now. Have I encountered anybody yet? No. It's just people all around. By people, I mean NPCs, but still. Hey, man. Let's go. You're foraging? That's cute. Well, that's unfortunate they had to bring your friend. B is dodge, not A, Mathis. Alright, well, now I've got to fight at least two. Thank you for beating each other up. That was actually awesome. I really enjoyed that. Why? Okay, they keep going back. So I, I got to I got to fight them both and I can't like leash them. I might die. Oh, Jesus. Come on. No level up full heal, huh? God damn. Anime this shit. Mathis. A is not dodge. Why is that like the thing that my body wants to do immediately? I did it again. Goodbye. Okay. Uh, I got my shit pushed in a little bit there. It looks like we got ourselves a sword. That's good. Oop. Okay, that's a healing ability on the bottom left. Let's meditate. Okay, I guess I didn't need that sword when I need to meditate. Great. Um. Stamina. Let's go up for a little bit on the stamina. <sighs> What is increased the quantity of tension caught and stored in a shard when performing a successful defensive ability? See, I don't know what that means. I'm gonna go up, up my strength a little bit here. How about we just, we don't throw our sword away. I feel like that might be a good move to not toss our sword into the ground. Okay. Out of power. Maybe shards charging ability charges up our power? Like, uh. Did the time just, like, speed up? Oh, cool. Forgotten Temple. Hey, how's it going up there, man? Hello? You look like you're guarding a weapon. You look like you just want to fight me. Okay, see, the thing is, though, I've got a sword and I've never used one before. He just, like, fucked my sword up. Okay, this guy has a lot of, it seems like, high attacks. I'm trying to dodge. Yeah, it looks like the shards actually charge up my power. Whoa, what the fuck was that? He just he just beat the sword out of my hands. Let's heal up a little bit and try not to die. This guy is destroying me left and right. The defensive, uh, defensive ability there does... Okay, there goes my sword. It's fine. It was a rusty blade. Okay, I'm down. Wow! You were defeated. Hold A to respawn now. Okay, uh, shit. What happens when you die? I'm back here. I saw a floating mask there. Does it do anything? Well, it's not there anymore. 
God, dude. I don't I don't know the timing yet on his fucking abilities. I just gotta it's stamina management. That time I actually like I kicked his ass, so I don't understand. Maybe that sword was just bad? And I'm glowing right now. Alright. Oh, no, no, no. I don't want two. Shit. I'm getting two. Honestly, ducking is like the only ability that I'm actually somewhat... Decent at here. All right. Awesome. We beat somebody. We got some shoes. And we got two shoes. All right. Well, let's take a look. Uh, yeah. I want those. And the paper doll effect. Yeah, I think we're wearing them. Alright, it's slowly starting to make sense. I wonder if a blocking is, is kind of like Dungeon Souls. Dungeon Souls. Dark Soulsy, where like blocking is good early on while you learn. But the, the less you block, the better, because it is a stamina hound. Come on, man. You got to come out from there. I can't. Here, you know what? You're going to let me heal? I'm going to heal then. That was a hell of a counter. Come on. What a block, I think? Okay. I don't well under I don't understand what happened there. I'm not entirely sure what happened there. Like, why all of a sudden I think she just canceled out the ability? Hey, man. I'm gonna take this, okay? How's it going? You will have to learn more attacks if you want to survive. If an unknown attack hits your guard, you will start learning it. If you use your combat style's ability against that attack, you will learn it even faster. But if you are defeated or flee combat, you'll lose all this experience. Victory is the only path to acquire knowledge. Okay. I gotcha. Well, I have to carry this sword. I tried to sheath it, but it didn't seem like it worked. There's a treasure up there. That looks like dangerous water. There's also like a weird noise coming from over here. It sounds like treasure. Hey man, how do you how do you get up here? I see you, but All right. All right, that actually, like, whooped her. Why did that not happen last time I played with a sword? I got my shit pushed in. Hey, man. Yeah, that right there. Sword's gone. Oh, God. Listen, let me heal. <laughs> let me... Listen, do you want a fair fight? Dear Gamer has entered the arena. That's, 
scares me a little bit. I'm blocking, man. Oh, god damn! Oh. It's so weird, like, sometimes I can get in the zone and I can whoop them, and other times not so much. I wonder if Dear Gamer is still in here. Now, mind you, the what I'm playing with is a, uh, a very early build of the game. That might be Dear Gamer right there. I do wonder if he's going to try and kill me. I don't. Okay. I'm gonna heal. I wonder if I can... I think he's watching. I don't know the range of that attack. All of our attacks seem to be pretty high. Oh no, don't get involved. I don't want to fight, but you might fight me. I don't want to I don't want to fight, but I'm going to go back this way where I was getting, I was fighting. So this guy wants to work with me cooperatively. That's neat. Unless he's gonna backstab me. I didn't mean to beat you up there, man. My bad. Cool. Now, oh, that was kind of neat. Teaming up and stuff. Uh, let's uh, equip our new pantalones. Yeah, see, that's what I want to see. I want to see better shit showing up. Let's meditate for a second. I'm going to go with one more point in dex here. For just faster damage. He's gone. Oh, he died. And then he entered. What? Well, we're going to activate this altar. Interact. I don't know what that does. Wait, this thing, I'm not in a school? Not in a school. All right, I don't know what that means. But that's like a full heal spot, it seems. Angrel, the second marked one. Okay, but first of all, Angrel, you have a buddy here. That's not okay. Oh, shit. Oh, this is gonna whoop me. not going to work out. Let's get my stamina up. See if we can drop a heal. Oh, God. I don't think we even got the heal in. No. I want to get rid of your freaking ad. Come down. Oh, my God, game. 
Well, hopefully this is like our respawn is right there. I'm gonna give it one more go. Yeah, it looks like it. Wait, what? Is there a map? Where am I? Did they send me all the way back? Where the hell am I? I think they sent me all the way back. All right, hang on. We're going back in here. I want to see if that was like a fight that I can get right back to. I thought that little that little shrine that we interacted with was like a respawn shrine. Oh, it was. I'm just dumb. I just got to play so defensive here. Reading their abilities is going to be so important to playing this game, I think. <sighs> Trying to jump over it, but I was way too early. I got to... So what I got to do is I got to not... I got to not be locked the fuck on. the fucking they do that every time and I'm like they fuck me up every single time they do it stop locking on if I could just get rid of one I'll feel like that was at least a little triumphant tried to go for the attack there I am just not yeah, if you could just beat up your friend for me, that would be ideal. Angrel, you want to go for that? Oh my god! One more, one more, one more, one more. Angrel's little minion. Doesn't even fight fair, but she's still fucked up. So they maintain some of the damage? Doesn't seem like they maintain all of it though. All right, let's get in here. Let's get our stamina back. That was bullshit. Thank you for killing your friend. Okay, now you. Stamina, no problem. Awesome. Try to go down and underneath it. He has this like low punch that he follows up with. Quick kick from this position. Nope, it's not this position. I'm gonna try and heal. That one's a quicker. That's not a quick kick, but. That was a good dodge on my part. I don't know what that blue thing is. Did you see that? Can you stop locking on just for a second and heal? Oh! Oh, no, no, no. So when you dodge, I'm starting to realize you actually drop your guard when you dodge. His fucking chains. It eats my stamina up. Oh, God. All right, we're going back in. 
Blocking does eat your stamina up. It's very Dark Souls in that regard. Where it, it's it's probably not the best thing to be doing, but for an early on... Oh, you suck. And then, of course, they're back. I mean, I don't understand what's going on there. I'm clearly blocking. I mean... Hey, dear gamer, if you could show up over here and just help me out. I'm dead. I'm getting a little sloppy, too. He's all effed up, though, still. I'm dead. We're gonna- we're gonna go in. We're going back in. I don't- I don't even care, man. Give me a- give me, like, an hour of this fucking game. I don't care. The game is complicated. Okay, he got his his life back apparently. It's all about timing. If I can time it properly, I don't know what that blue thing is, but if I can time it properly and burn their stamina, it's probably in, in my best interest. Why am I attacking him? I want to attack her. Kill the ad. Heal. Okay, we're back in it. Come on, Angrel. Let's go, fam. The range on that is just not high. Healing. Fuck. His little haymaker. And that little blue bullshit. Heal just takes so long that it's actually almost, it's almost not worth it. He like transfers it. Like the blue damage becomes like temporary. Oh, I don't even know what happened there. When I hit him when he's blue, it, it almost feels like it becomes temporary. All right, I can hear him in there fighting. Angrel, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta focus on you, man. It's just you're, you're all nonsense fighting assholes. If I could just put me between you and your minion, maybe your minion's AI is too stupid to realize that she's throwing punches at you. That's 
fine. <sighs> Come on. It just ate all my stamina, really? I mean, like, I guess I'm just, I'm not fully understanding the language of the game still, which is frustrating me a bit, and I don't know how to make this work. <sighs> I, was, I was thinking, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go, I'm going one more, man. I'm going one more. Please tell me he still has his damage done. He has the damage he had before. Come on. I almost, I don't, I, I have a hard time wanting to critique this game because it's still so early. And I've only been playing it for, what, an hour, maybe, at this point? But it feels like the uh, multi-fighting is, is a bit... A bit too messy. Like, there's too much going on. This game almost feels like it definitely flourishes. If you had uh, a... A one-on-one situation instead of a two-on-two. Or two on one, rather. Yeah. Because you can't really focus on the one when he's too busy. Like, you've got one... One swinging at you. And then if you're... If you even open yourself up for a second to, like, drop an attack... You... You, uh... You leave yourself wide open for the other one to come in and just do shit to you. Yeah, I'm dead again. But I, I don't know. I don't know if that's a valid critique quite yet on that. Or if it's just me being whiny and maybe like I'm just in over my head with like my gear right now. Am I in an area that I shouldn't be? Is this the guy I should not be fighting quite yet? I don't know. And now his friend is gone. Wait, what? Why is his friend gone? My guess either one is like, oh, you're, you're like getting your ass whooped, or be, maybe it was all being like two on one because there was a the gamer guy was around, dearest gamer. It's possible that was it, but that would also be kind of garbage then because like the difficulty range would just spike constantly. I think that, that little jingling noise when you're swinging is uh, indicative of you chaining properly. Be careful. Let's not get greedy. Yeah, taunt me all you want. I'm healing. Whenever he does the blue, he always comes in with like a freaking haymaker. We got him. Holy crap, man. Holy crap is right. Whew, we got a little bit wrecked there. Um, can't up our mobility. I want to get my dex to at least 10. But I'm going to wrap up the episode here. I don't, if you guys want to see more, you let me know in the comment section below. Uh, if so, you know, hit the like button, comments, and all that good stuff, especially on a new potential series. Knowing the support is going to be the most important part. Hope you guys enjoyed, and maybe, maybe I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.